about how you got to the position, uh, where you're coming from, that sort of thing. Sure. Um, so I started my career as a history teacher in Methuen. Um, taught there for 11 years, was at the high school. I uh, was also a department head for history for a short time and then got an offer to be an assistant principal at Haverhill High School. Okay. Um, and I've been there, well, I was there for seven years before this opportunity arose this past spring. And um, I mean, you know, I, in the last couple of days, it's definitely coming to light that this is, this is absolutely the right place. I mean, uh, mm -hmm. we're, we're having a great start. Things what what well. indicates that to you? Um, the faculty, excuse me, um, the faculty are, are so receptive and they're, they're right off the bat, you can see how much they care for the kids. Um, and that's a big part of who I am. Um, you know, my, my big uh, philosophy is, is having a strong climate and culture within the building where we are supportive, we celebrate, um, whether it's academic, personal, I told them silly, you know, um, across the board, we're, we're gonna you know, promote everything that's going on within the building and the faculty is receptive to that and they you can truly see that they care for kids and, and it fits right into where I'm where I'm hoping to go. So. Mm -hmm. What drew you to teaching and then administrative work? Um, you know, I, I wasn't actually going to be a teacher when I came out of college. Mm -hmm. um, I got a degree in history and I... From where? From Holy Cross. Okay. And um, started actually in real estate um, uh, and uh, hated it mm -hmm. and you know took a job substituting once uh, that kind of fell apart this was a couple years out of college mm -hmm. and um, fell in love with it um, and figured out that was where I was supposed to be my father was was uh, on his way to be a teacher and then stopped and kind of got into sales and always told me that he wished he continued with that mm -hmm. um, and you know just kind of grew from there had a great great department that I began with in Methuen and um, learned a lot, had some wonderful mentors and and uh, when the, what, what happened with administration was that at the time I was teaching I wanted to get you know some more credits to uh, improve my standing, took some administration courses and immediately we said no this is this is where I need to go, this is where I want to be um, because I can do so much with kids but I really, I would like to drive what it, where school is going and what we're doing, you know, and, and what our vision is. And, um, so that's why I turned towards admin. So you wanted to have your hand in the structural aspect? Yes. Yeah. 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 But not just, I mean, I, 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 I do miss teaching mm -hmm. a lot. Um, and the nice part about this position now is when I was an assistant principal, I had a lot more focus on, you know, student discipline and um, assorted projects. Um, being the head of the building, I can actually get back into the classrooms now and see what's going on with the teachers. And um, I'm hoping at some point to maybe pop in and teach a couple of lessons here and there because I do miss it. Mm -hmm. um, but I do uh, shaping where we're going as as a as a group, um, kids, faculty, you know, um, where our community's headed. Um, that's a that's a big draw for me. Mm -hmm. What kind of